<laughs> bye bye. Yeah, next time I can join the join the band. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, thanks. Bye bye. Yeah, see you soon. Have you seen this? Yeah, Would you like to try a demonstration? Oh, okay. Nice to see your ridges again. Yeah, check it out. Vancouver Island and Haida Gwaii, shaped oh. like the head of an alligator coming up out of the water. Wow. So its body's underwater and its tail's lashing around. <laughs> you know anything about alligators and their mothering skills? No. What? Some of the best mothers in nature, really? when they, uh, they dig a hole, lay their eggs, bury them, and unlike turtles, turtles swim out to sea and leave their babies to, to fend for their young. Uh -huh. Alligators stay with their nest and wait until they hatch, and then they'll dig up the nest, and they'll actually pick babies up in their mouth, roll them around in their mouth to help their young emerge, and then carry them around in their mouth. Well, what's going on in the mouth of this alligator right now? Well, let me show you. This, for one, so this is uh, Lemons Inlet and Mears Island here, and I see them being shaped as Bambi. Wow! Little, little spots on his bum, little antler <laughs> here. And all that. So, Bambi there. See the same Bambi here? This oh, yeah. is Mears Island, the Asalas, wow. the peninsula. I see them being shaped like a baby dragon hatching wow. out of an egg, wow. out of an empty hand. So this baby dragon uh, is uh, is located right there. There's the there's the dragon in the hand, the Bambi right there. So I see coastal British Columbia as this Neat. giant alligator. It's gone to its nest, picked up its egg, rolled it around in the mouth. Instead of it coming out as a as a uh, alligator, it came out as a baby dragon. Wow! And then I apply this perspective that covers. That covers coastal British Columbia, and I apply that perspective to North America, South America, and the, the rest of the Great. world, and come up with this whole crazy little... Excellent. More information on my Facebook page. Join All us, right. spread it. Teachings of the White Raven. Teachings of the White Raven. In fact, on a doctor show I saw the other day, uh, they were talking about memory training for the brain. They were saying how if you want to memorize things, you don't just memorize names. You have to equate it with some picture or image in your mind. Oh yeah, right on. Huh? Cool, that's... That's what you've done. Ninth wonder of the world. Ninth wonder of the you world. Beat, you beat me to number eight. <laughs> <laughs> well, I lost my didgeridoo this morning, but I went back home and got one of my past didgeridoo prototypes. Oh yeah. And I don't have a mouthpiece on it yet, but it sounds exceptionally deep in tone. Oh yeah. Where is your other one? Just left it at home? Or? I, uh, uh, I left... I left it on top of my car and when I came back it was gone. Uh, so, but in one way or another. So, but I'm gonna make some more. Yeah, right on. Bye bye. Cheers, have a good day.